Engineered with the input of leading research scientists, Autodesk Maya software offers innovative dynamic simulation features to help you create stunning effects. A range of easy-to-use, customizable effects are available in the form of Effects Assets and can be found in the Maya Visor window. Preset effects include explosions, fire, smoke, rain, fireworks, and basic liquid simulation. They can be quickly imported into your scene, applied to objects, then played and rendered with little or no modification. Further development of the Nucleus Unified Simulation Framework and its associated modules delivers improved liquid simulation with new pouring, splashing, and boiling effects, multi-threaded end-particle collisions, and end-cloth self-collisions for faster performance. A number of new liquids attributes let you generate fluid effects that look and behave like real liquids. New liquid simulation methods let you select a solver that best suits your effect. When Enable Liquid Simulation is turned on, you can select either liquid and air or density-based mass as your simulation method. The liquid min density specifies the density value at which the solver differentiates between liquid and air when the liquid and air simulation method is used. Liquid densities are calculated as incompressible fluids while air is fully compressible. The liquid mistfall attribute applies a downward force to areas in the fluid that have low density. When liquid mistfall is set to zero, no force is applied. Increasing the attribute value increases the strength of the downward force. Four key attributes to control density tension and pressure are also available. You can use tension force with density tension to create realistic surface tension in your liquid effect. Density pressure applies an outward force to counter the compression that forward advection can apply to fluid density. For example, in a water tank simulation, fluid may appear to collapse or drain without sufficient density pressure. Highly realistic shattering simulations with multiple interacting materials are more easily achievable with the help of the included Digital Molecular Matter plugin. DMM is a material physics simulator that uses the finite element method to make objects in a virtual world behave as if they were made from real world materials. In the simulator, each object is represented as a tetrahedral mesh. A physical material is a set of parameters that control how a simulated object behaves. A physical materials library is also included in Maya with the plugin. The plugin automatically prepares surface meshes for deformation fracture. The plugin can export DMM objects for import into a game engine containing the DMM simulator. As well, the plugin also contains a DMM simulator so a user can run simulation in Maya to preview how objects will act in a game environment. The plugin lets the user mix Maya animation with DMM simulation and create dynamic animation sequences for replay in a game. Of course, Maya can also be used to render videos that contain DMM simulation. The NVIDIA Physics for Maya plugin lets you take advantage of using GPU accelerated physics simulations in your Maya scenes. The plugin lets you create dynamic, kinematic, and static rigid bodies from meshes created in Maya. You can then join the rigid body objects with physics constraints. The physics plugin also includes kinematic ragdoll simulations and Apex clothing. The Apex Clothing plugin for Maya allows artists and designers to author and set up the physical parameters and meshes required for hybrid clothing simulation algorithms. The data is generated from your working mesh and its simulation behavior can be tuned through a set of uniform parameters and vertex level painting allowing for fine grain control of each region of the mesh. The Physics plugin for Autodesk Maya is designed to provide a convenient interface to add realistic GPU accelerated physics simulations to your project. Running the simulation combines the outcome of the physics calculations with your own predefined animations. The result is displayed entirely within the viewports of Maya in real time. 